How's it going everybody? My name is MDKWLAN, otherwise known as MDK, and today we are on Ubuntu 12.04, and interesting thing happened. Counter-Strike 1.6 is now beta for Linux, which is interesting. So, it was rumored before that Left 4 Dead and the whole Source engine was already ported over to Linux before the whole uh, Steam went beta, but... We haven't seen much of it. Well, well, to be honest, we haven't seen any of it. So far, the only thing that uses the Source Engine that is Linux is Team Fortress 2. So, we have yet to see Counter-Strike Source, Counter-Strike Go, Half-Life 1 and 2, you know, all those games. Well, Half-Life 1, there's a version of it that runs on Source, but the original one doesn't use Source. It uses its own engine. So, it's interesting, because I was playing this before, just trying it out, and... I'm a Counter-Strike fan, like, I like Counter-Strike, well, uh, I like Counter-Strike Source and Counter-Strike Go, but I normally, all again, I always play them on the Windows on my computer because they're the most stable over there. And in order to have an enjoyable gaming experience, you obviously want to have a stable environment. Like, honestly, graphics doesn't bother me. You can have the shittiest graphics as long as the gameplay is fun and enjoyable, I'll play it. That's why I like Quake. That's why I like Open Arena. They're both really solid games. Aesthetics doesn't matter to me. But to other people, aesthetics mean everything, which is kind of sad. Um, and it also is like all commentary about people. You know, a lot of gamers, PC gamers, are associated with Windows. But I don't think it's so much that they're associated with Windows because they're Windows fanboys or or anything. It's just that's what right now every game runs on pretty much that that's pretty much why and honestly if you're a PC gamer and you know every game now is starting to have a Linux variation why wouldn't you switch to Linux in my opinion and a lot of other people have been able to replicate it is that um all these games are running better on Linux i get a better frame rate in team fortress 2 in Linux than i do in windows and that's with max settings. Now, granted, there's a difference between OpenGL and DirectX, but I don't know, even really know if there is a comparison there. Anyway, uh, I, be I believe it was Chris Perillo that pretty much said, if you're a PC gamer, what doesn't matter what operating system you're on? So, anyway, I'm going to try to show footage here of playing it, but... I don't know how well that'll work because the game itself runs fine and from my point of view it'll run fine it's the recording software for Linux isn't that great and I don't know if it'll capture well enough so I'm just gonna load up a game it doesn't I'm not gonna look for network or anything like that and god this is incredibly loud but for you I have no idea how this looks for me it looks seamless and I'm out of the buy zone, I guess. There you go. But, I don't know. It's... And again, this is based off of the Half-Life engine and not anything in particular. Like uh, the Source engine or anything. So this is a fairly old game. Okay. So I just wanted some footage there to show off how it actually runs, and if it looks choppy, because I'm probably just going to upload this as is, but if it looks choppy, it's really not, because it's the recording software, it's not the game itself. The game itself runs smooth as, I don't know, smooth as very smooth objects. Ball bearings? But yeah, also Half-Life, the original, is in beta as well, so... If you guys want to check it out, you guys already have these games for Steam. Load up Steam on your Ubuntu machine or any variant of Linux, pretty much. I think everything has Linux now. Even Gentoo, which, that's actually scary now that I think about that. How long it takes to emerge packages when you're just doing updates for the system stuff and then you you download Steam <laughs> And then you download a game. Do you have to merge the game too? Oh god. That doesn't sound fun at all. But yeah, like system wide updates in Gen 2 take fucking forever. God. Anyway, that's 
Half-Life beta and well Counter-Strike beta one or Counter-Strike 1.6 on Ubuntu 12.04 using an AMD graphics card, a 6600 series. Yeah, 6600 series. So give me a yell guys if you guys want me to look at anything else or cover any other topics. That's it. Have a good one guys. See ya.